All right, so this is another um, slot machine app or program, uh, this time using JavaFX. So I'll play it for you first. All right, so uh, immediately it asks for the user to enter an amount to play with. I'll say 100 for $100. Click spin. Um, and if the user gets two of these images correct, um, then they would earn two times the amount that they uh, put in. And if they get all three right, then they earn three times. Um, but if none of the images match, then they lose everything that they put in. So in this case, um, the user basically lost money. They did not win any money. Okay, um, so I'll spin it again so you can see. Um, I just got these images off of Google. I tried to make them slot machine um, as far as the slot machines I know of. Um, you know, like the coins, the fruit, the diamonds, the sevens, cherries, the buffalo, the eagle, the tiger that type of stuff. Um, so that's pretty much it. Um, I could have added some sleep. It's like some kind of a sleep method, I remember, um, to kind of make it seem like it's some sort of a spin going on. Um, it looks very basic right now. Um, I know that. But that's the slot machine, OK? Um, so let me show you this code here. Um, it's actually not too lengthy, um, so I'll, I'll go through it here. Um, imports up here at the top, of course. Um, and then we have our public class slot machine FX extends the application because we're using Java FX. Um, and just uh, setting up the visuals, like the layouts, uh, the GUI components and stuff of that nature. Um, so uh, going through here, um, again, kind of setting up those uh, visuals uh, for the user. OK. Um, and I'm just scrolling through here, see which what I want to talk more about. Um, so this is going off of random numbers. So the images that I have, um, this was actually the first program that I used. Uh, well, actually, no, it wasn't. I have another one I'm going to show in a minute, but. Um, these images, I, I stored them in a, a folder within the source package. Here, I'm using NetBeans. I'm going to switch to IntelliJ or Eclipse because I've been told it's better. But um, outside of the package of the app, I have um, an image folder that I set up in my uh, root computer. Um, before, when I put my images in here, I was having an issue with it rendering within the, not the viewport, but the actual JavaFX pane, um, because I named the images off of what they look like, like the buffalo, the tiger, diamond, whatever. Um, and the only one that didn't that was actually showing was the number seven because I named it the number seven. And I didn't realize the reason why they weren't showing is because I didn't have my images saved as actual numbers um, because the images are pulling off of this random um, number generator where it's taking, and I'll show you down here, um, so in the display calculate, um, this method here, um, if you notice, I have the path calling for the images, 
it's saying the images that's the images folder taking any random number uh, and then the dot jpg at the end so I couldn't use like a png or a gif it would have to be a jpg and any random number of those and then that's how it shows um, so that's how it's calling those images okay um, and it's doing it again um, for three times because I'm showing three different um, images on the slot machine and if they match if any if two of them match then um, it will multiply it by two if all three of them match it will multiply it by three um, and so that's really honestly uh, this slot machine it's um, it looks a little bit better than the initial one that I did but um, overall it's a similar concept so I'll play it for you one more time and I'll do fifty dollars this time um, and you can add music or whatever if you want or like some kind of sound to make it better make the images larger like I, I could have done that I just have been a little bit pressed for time with um, a lot of final projects being due all at once so that's pretty much it but um yeah that is the slot machine simulator uh program i want to call it an application but it's it's not really an app it's a program um so that's it um if you have any questions feel free to let me know but i hope you have a good night